Hello everybody, I am Brantman19 and welcome to episode 21 of our United Provinces campaign in Empire Total War. So, last episode we did some more economic things as well as getting our armies completely ready for these next few moves. Because we're going to purge the area south of this line right here of enemy troops, at least this turn. So, I want to go ahead and take these guys in here. And let's see, it'll be 1470 versus 246, so it should be a quick battle, I would think. At least I hope it will. I hope we'd knock them out, too. They've already retreated once this turn. Let's hope they can't retreat again, or at least not far if they do. Okay, these two. Up here. You, uh, let's put you on the right, you on the left, you in the center. Let me grab all my other troops in deployment. Let's go. Let's get out of the road now at the bottom there. Don't think we knocked any of them out. get to the high ground here. Let's just go ahead and run them into position so they're ready to fire when they get there. Let these guys keep firing. Maybe they'll get lucky. Oh, they did get lucky. It's like they knocked out one of the general's bodyguard. Ready and stop. No more fire. Ooh, there goes a shot. And we'll get ready for a second one. And a third. He's already broken. These guys are wavering. I don't know if they have fire by rank or not. It doesn't seem to be. Okay, next. I don't mind them sticking around. Oh, we shattered him. He's shattered. Both the generals are dead. But the units that were generals are down dead. And these guys are going to reload. Let go on these two, I hope. Shattered, he's shattered. Broken only. And shattered. Let's see if we can get another shot into his back. Nope, okay. Let's wait it out. Oh, these guys can shoot these ones. Okay. Let's go ahead and move them in closer. They seem to be broken. Oh, okay. Well, in the battle. Heroic victory. Hopefully that knocked them all the way out. Yep, that knocked them all the way out. I'm going to go ahead and move over here. 1437 versus 483. They do have a cannon. Okay. Let's put 
these guys back here. Here, left, right in the turn. Yeah, they start very far away. Okay. Move these guys down there, like so. Turn you off. Take this guy. Put him off over there. One, two, three, four guys killed from our own shots. Hate to see that. Get in position, hurry it up, hurry it up, hurry it up, hurry it up, hurry it up. We're gonna be clashing with the peasantry with this group. Our guys were running, they got caught in the run. Go ahead and fire. Oh, they're shattered. broken. What are these horse doing? Forward some more. Okay, go ahead and shoot these lancers. There you go. Yeah, he's shattered. Let's move these guys up to here. Move these guys up to there. up.
Alright, take your shots into this guy. Shouldn't have done that, that's alright. And this last guy down here is the one taking all the hits right now. And they're getting done, they're about to get done reloading. Up here it goes. There goes the next. And yeah, he's broken and shattered. Alright, all's good. I think we've won this one. Heroic victory. Probably lost about 115 guys. 108. Killed 463, so I guess I guess technically that's enough to keep going. Okay, let's fix up all these armies. This guy comes back here. Go down to 872. Let's come back over here, take a look. Oh, we still got one more turn on these guys. Then we'll move them over. Uh, this guy's got two more turns. Okay. I get 41 49 a turn right now. It could be more, and that's what we're going for. Oh, they want to go to war here. 1020 against 120. We have a 900 man advantage. Alright, let's do this. it. Oh, whoops, I didn't even set these guys up. That's alright. Terrible first shots. So let's go ahead and set ourselves up for uh, canister loads, which we could have already done, I guess. Let's hope they continue up the hill more. Though they could use a little bit more training. Killed off a little bit on the right. And he's broken. Up oh, there, that one goes running. Shattered.
Yep, in the battle. Then we killed one, we killed all of them, and we took over Cuba. Oh yes, he's going to go on back north. There is a port in this region that has not yet been developed. Select the type of port to construct here. A fishing port will help your population grow. A trade port will provide an income from overseas trade. A naval port allows the construction of warships. Dang it, I'm, try I'm trying my hardest to get Protestantism going in France. I know they've got to have all their missionaries and all that here, but I just think it'd be funny. I've never converted a whole other nation, and I think that would be how you would do it, though. Okay, we got quite a bit of money. 4385. Let's come back over here and look. Oh, what's all this? Military technology. Let's see. Oh, recruitment report. Yeah, come on across here. Wait, who's the one guy hurt? This guy? There you go. That fixes him. Turn this into a church school. Trading center. We'll get rid of that. This is like one of the first times I've had extra money to do whatever I wanted with. Um... Let's see, Ottoman Empire, request peace. You know, I don't mind giving you that stuff. Especially since we're getting a trade agreement out of it. Um, cannot trade with Russia. Ports in their home region are at full capacity, and a sea route from their capital cannot be established. Okay. They're unfriendly with Denmark. Yeah, they definitely don't want it. Okay. Fine with me. Let's see. Yeah. Making five thousand forty seven per turn right now. Look back over here. I'm trying to figure out, okay, so what's my next move? My next move is going to be to get these guys forward. I mean, I could go here to that, then take that. Meantime, have these guys move up to there. There, there, and hope they don't come across this. Could just go here and there. Again, hoping they don't go around. Their newest capital's here. Gujarat. Can I pull out of here yet? No, not quite. But here. Oh yeah, I can pull out of there though. Now this guy's gonna go here. It'll take him two turns. The reason why I'm doing it like this is because I can go here, and then I can, can pull up to here, 
and pull and pull up to here, then pull up to here. And hopefully stop them doing anything in that region. Or I could bring this guy around as well to here. I bear a bat and be just fine. Alright, let's let the game spin on whatever it wants. Just, I think it just tried to fix things, so that's alright. See, that guy's just like a little raiding guy. He ain't gonna do anything. Except for raid around for a little while. There is a port in this region that has not yet been developed. Select the type of port to construct here. A fishing port will help your population grow. A trade port will provide an income from overseas trade. A naval port allows the construction... Oh, I'm not gonna worry about him. One thing that does need to be done, and I'm going to spend the money to go and get it done here. Settlement fortifications. I don't have it there, and it needs to be done. Um, the rest of them, I think, all have it, though. Yeah, they do. Okay. Um, this guy's all perfectly good. Let's send him on. It's okay. Keep this guy here. There's only one guy here. It's not a big deal. There's really nobody around this, so we can just... Siege it down when we're ready. Um, this one's got a while to go anyway. Let's use this guy to go ahead and knock this one out. And push them on further. Let's go ahead and knock this guy out too. I couldn't quite knock them all the way out, but go and fix up this army. His next move is going to go to there. I'm going to wait till I have this guy sieged up before I move this guy, I think. In the turn. Didn't spend any money that time. Which is alright, I guess. I, I mean, I wish we would have used some to repair up some other stuff, but... It's alright. And there's the Ottomans. Gotta rebuild that trust and that friendship with them. Oh, they're t are they... Oh no, they're going in there. That's fine. That's not gonna add on to the time or anything. There is a port in this region that has not yet been developed. What is this? Select the type of port to construct. Oh, Lancers. A fishing port will help your population grow. A trade port will provide an income from overseas trade. A naval port allows the construction of warships. Okay. Um, we're at 6868. Put this guy on around. So now we've safely defended New Granada and Bogota down there. Over time, this one will get fixed up and nice and ready to go. We do have a church. They are at war with Sweden. Their allies are Russia. They do not like us because of territorial expansion and different governments. But we are the same religion, so we should be better friends. Hmm... Wait, what's going on up here? Look at the French! Dang, the French have driven a lot out here. 
That's why I need to hurry up and secure the Maratha down. And put, I put one army over here just to kind of keep it around. Move all my other armies over here to the New World. Yep, four and five. They got a while to go. And these guys aren't going to be able to come fill that void. Let's go here so we can block this guy. And maybe we can get him to move up this way. Or out of that. We can move, maybe move him away from one of these because I want to switch it over after a while. There you go. There you go. Everything's fixed up. Or will be getting fixed. In the turn. Ooh, I don't know where that was. It was a pretty huge fleet, though. There's unused land suitable okay, for plantations. Rakes, in this Cuba. Building plantations here will increase your nation's export capacity, improving income through international trade. New nation arises, Georgia. Oh, here. Okay. <laughs> I was like, which Georgia? How's research going? Okay, they're working on this stuff. They're also working over here. Oh, that'd be good. Minus 50 to re uh, religious unrest. That's a big problem I'm having here. No villages here are growing. Go hold on to that. That's got four more turns. These guys over here are marching to here. Up oh, the side, he's gonna do a little kick out there. Hold on one second. It's the first time I've seen it do that in a while. Anyways, here we are. So, um, yeah, we're just gonna kind of push up to here and hold that line. Even though I probably could take this back. Yeah, probably. Hmm. Well, you need to be done, too. In the turn. Spend a little bit of money. Probably on roads or something in the region, but that's alright. Oh, there's that huge fleet. Doesn't have anybody on it, it doesn't look like. Swedes messing around in Denmark. I think if I took two more regions away from the Maratha, they don't ha they wouldn't be able to go forward anymore. There is a port in this region that has not yet been developed. Select the type of port to construct here. A fishing port will help your population grow. A trade port will provide an income from overseas trade. A naval port allows the construction of warships. Oh, we're almost equal with the Maratha now. Our military is not as high. Our naval is just a little below. Our economic is 
below too, but our enlightenment enlightenment's huge, especially compared to everybody else. Our enlightenment is just more than Sweden as is. It won't take long for our economy to come around too once this guy's done through here. I'll switch them all over or switch him over to here. And the rest can probably, we'll probably switch over too. Okay. Um, it's going to take two turns. Religious unrest is switching. We're going up 4% per turn, by the way, here for our religion. Let's see. Um, go ahead and push further. Yeah, you're definitely not going to get around this now. Might go ahead right here. We'll make him there. What are those troops? Riflemen? Oh, there's only 60 in it, so that doesn't really do us that much. Um, Scots. 120 of them. 70, 40, 25. Really not... I mean, they're better in charge bonus and defense and stuff, but that's about it. Yeah, the Swiss infantry is way better anyway. I can't do that right now, can I? Another oh, Scots. I can only have six Swiss infantry anyway. Okay, all right. Well, I'm going to go into it right here. I appreciate y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Maybe check out Discord, and I will see you all next time.